Holland is known for its greenery, low density landed district, good schools and also Holland Village. Today we'll be taking a look at a corner terrace in the Grove Drive address. Renovated for $1.2 million in 2016, it comes with 7 bedrooms, a swimming pool, lift and even an outdoor gym. Let's go check it out. The moment you walk in, you realise how wide the front part of the house is. This is because the end-to-end -end width of the house is a very good 10 metres, which is bigger than most semi-D's width of 8 metres. So this is the reason why we are able to have a car porch for two cars and also an access for an outdoor area. The outdoor area is my favourite part of the house. This is because it has been elevated from the ground compared to the car porch. Now this front part of the house is a very nice area for family to be in and also importantly a safe space for the children to play within and also it is directly connected to the living room entrance of the house. Well, this is it. The entire property has been fully redesigned and renovated. The internal build-out space is 3,743 square feet, not including the car park porches and the outdoor space, while the land size is about 5,000 square foot. Now over here, we have a kitchen that overlooks the entire dining and living area. What I also noticed as I stepped into the unit is that there is so much natural sunlight that comes into the unit. This is because the owner has changed the doors into full high sliding glass at the side and also at the front of the house. So when we are in the living room, we are sitting down watching TV, there is natural light coming in from the side of the house and also we are able to have the glass doors that overlook the car porches outside. The dining area is huge. So if you like to have a dining set here for 10 packs, 12 packs, no problem. You have a very big family, you like to do hosting all the time, you have a lot of friends, guests coming all the time. This will be a place that they will be able to spend quality time in. Now, look how it interacts with the outside space. So this is dining area, and as we walk out to the space here, currently owner has done up a gym here, which is connected to the backyard and also the pool area, which we will get to it later. But imagine this area, we can also have an alfresco dining set placed out over here. One of the highlights of this house is the kitchen. The kitchen has been designed to have plenty of windows opening to the side and to the back, allowing maximum natural light and air into the unit. We also are able to have a view into the pool and also to the outdoors. The kitchen is fully equipped. It comes with a lot of cabinets, so if you have a lot of kitchen accessories, equipment, no problem. We have a cooker gas, hood and hop here. We have a microwave system, we have a convection oven, and also an induction cooker. Now, the kitchen is designed such that family members of the house and guests in the living room are able to have a very interactive setting. Now before we move to the second part of the house, there is also a storage room over here and then we can also have the guests using the toilets here, this is a common bath As we move along, we have a pantry here that you can also use for storage and over here, we also have the maid's room and we are not even halfway done so now I'm going to bring you to the pool section of the house I'm now currently in the pest area. We have a cute little dog here with a bunny here. This is a very nice area because it connects very nicely to the pool area. Now children, family members can all play around here. There's a lot of privacy. This area, we are actually able to connect to the front porch. So if you like to have pool parties, you have friends coming in, they don't need to go through your house if they don't want to. Now fronting the pool, we have two fully fitted bedrooms. So the bedrooms here, one of them is attached and are used by the children of the house currently. So from the pets area, we can also walk 
on this pool deck towards the backyard of the house. So this back of the house is a very nice place because we can have an alfresco dining set or we can have a family area over here. The location of this corner terrace is worth mentioning in terms of proximity to MRT station and amenities such as wet market and food centres. We already know that the Holland Landed Estate and the Mount Sinai area is well known for being very near to prominent schools such as Henry Park Primary and also tertiary education institutions such as Singapore Poly, Singapore Institute of Technology and National University of Singapore among many others. Now a lot of landed property buyers may find it challenging to search for an address that is both within walking distance to MRT and also near amenities and market. So we are only about 12 minutes walk to Dover MRT station which is on the east-west line and also using a shortcut we are about 10 minutes walk away to Gimo Market which has a huge heartland food centre and tons of neighbourhood shops for our daily needs. This address right here has both the tranquility and peace that the landed owner should enjoy and yet having the convenience of being near an MRT station, amenities and market. Now before I show the master room, I'm going to bring you back to the front part of the house where there is a different set of stairs bringing us to another family area with three bedrooms. On this part of the level 2 of the house, there is actually a full apartment suite set up. I'm now in the family area and also comes with a three bedroom, all of them with attached bath. So if you'd like to stay together with an extended family or your children and grandparents, you can all stay together and yet have your own privacy. Now this entire area can also be changed to an office if you like, or also a junior master's since it already comes with an attached bath, it will be very easy to do. The level 2 family area faces the front of the house. This is where the lift is also located. So if you need your place to be wheelchair accessible, this is where you can be able to access the lift. Let's take a look at the master's room now. The master's is very private because there's a different set of stairs to get to it. From the stairs landing here, we have a reading area and this is the entrance to the master room. We have a very nice and simple setup here. This is a king size bed, but what I really want to show you is the master closet. The master bedroom has been remodeled to have this gigantic wardrobe space. It's a walk-in closet, so if you have a lot of suits, accessories, dresses, this would be a very, very nice place to have. So big. I'm excited to show you the master bathroom. Are you ready? This is the master bathroom. It's huge. You can even fit in an entire family in here. We have a vanity top here for him and for her, so we don't have to decide who gets to use the sink first. The condition of the house is fantastic and very suitable for multi-generational living. So if you don't want a construction timeline of one or two years, and also spending your weekends meeting your architects, meeting your designers, and pouring over the details of your renovation and your design timeline by a renovated house like this. So that's it. If you are looking for a freehold property, newly renovated and suitable for multi-generational living, this will be the property for you. We are near MRTs, we are near amenities, so lifestyle will be very easy for you and your family. This is all for today and thank you for watching.